In this video, you're going to learn how to create a video views custom audience, another extremely valuable custom audience that you can create. And the great news is, is you don't need to have a website, an email list, or even a lot of engagements on your Facebook page to create this. So what we're really talking about here is on your Facebook page, if you have created videos, you can create a custom audience for people who have watched those videos. So for example, here we are on my Facebook page, I have two videos here and you can see that I've got 1500 views on one and about 600 views on another. And what I want to do is really create an audience for those people who have watched those videos and I could then target an ad with another video for them or even follow up with a related opt-in to an email list or a product that was related to what I talked about in the video. Creating a video views custom audience is very, very simple. You just need to come once again into your Facebook ads manager and into your audiences tab. Once inside, then you just click on create audience here in the top left hand corner, select custom audience. You want to come down and select engagements on Facebook and the type of engagement you want to use to create this audience is going to be the video option here. Now, once inside, you have the option to set the parameters for this custom audience. How broad or narrow do you want this to be? And the first uh, variable here is how much of the video people watched. So you can see here that people who watch at least three seconds of the, your video, people who viewed at least 10 seconds, 25%, etc., all the way to the end. And obviously, as you go, and if, for example, you selected people who watch 95% of your video, those people are going to be extremely interested in maybe your follow up campaign, but it's going to be a much, much smaller audience. And for example, to give you a breakdown of some numbers for my video that I used to set up this custom audience, I had 1500 views. When I selected to create a custom audience for people who'd watch at least three seconds, that was 1200 people. So almost everybody who watched the video would be included. When I bumped this up to 10 seconds, the custom audience was just 500 people. So a third of the total amount of views that I got in the video. So as you can see, the numbers drop pretty dramatically based on the setting that you take. For now, let's just select three seconds so we can include as many people as possible. Next up, then you choose the video or videos that you want to include in this custom audience. I've got two videos here on my Facebook page. Uh, they're not really related to each other in terms of the topics. So right now I'm just going to select one, uh, one video here. Now, if I wanted to just show somebody another video in a targeted ad to drive video views, then I could maybe select both of these because I know those people watch videos. And so if I have another videos views ad, there's a good chance that they're going to watch that. However, if I wanted to create a custom audience where I was following up with an opt in or a product related to this video, it's probably better just to pick one video and keep it on topic. Or if you have a number of different videos related to that same topic, then select those. Once you've selected your video, go ahead and click confirm. You also have the option then to set the uh, time parameters for this custom audience. And you could set this to people who've watched videos in the last month. I'm just going to leave it at 365 to include as many people as possible. Then you want to give your audience name as usual. So I'm going to put in video views, custom audience, 365 days. And I've already got one set up. So I'm just putting, going to put in number two here so I can tell them apart. Then you just click create audience. And remember once again, that it will take up to 30 minutes for your audience to be ready to use. You can click next and then you have the option to create an ad or expand your audience using a lookalike audience. So I'm going to click done there. Now, as you can see, this is populating that message might switch to your audience is too small, but just leave it a full half an hour that will change. And you can see the audiences that I've set up already here. We had people who watched 10 seconds, that was 500 people, so a smaller number. And then people who just watched three seconds of video, much bigger number, 1300 people. Now you might be wondering, okay, well I have no views on my videos right now. If I publish a view to my page, 
I'll be looking to get five or 10 views. Well, here is the workaround for you. First thing you need to do is create a video and upload it to your Facebook page. Then what you could do is to create a video views campaign. So come into your ads create tool, select your marketing objective for video views. Then you can go down and in the format and media here, just select your video as the video for the campaign. On the back of that, when you've got maybe a thousand views in that video through your paid advertisement, you could create a custom audience from those video views. And then once you have that custom audience, you could use it maybe to follow up with an opt-in to an email list or a product or whatever the next step in your marketing funnel is. So that is how you could build up a video views custom audience from scratch, from literally having no Facebook fans, custom website audience, email list or anything. You can really start with a video, push that video in an ad, build a custom audience on the back of it, and then follow up with the next advertisement for an opt-in, etc. So now that you know how to set up a video views custom audience, go ahead and set one up for yourself following the steps that you've learned in this video.